Is it only me that's left? Okay. Uh, I have, I'm presenting uh, the two uh, bills under my name and then also Senator Steinberg's um, CTC, California Transportation Commission. Uh, Senator Walters, you're going to chair? I'll take up Senator Steinberg first. Okay. Uh, this is SB 126. Uh, it, established a, it establishes a uniform statutory process for the California Transportation Commission to follow when adopting transportation program guidelines. This bill specifically requires the commission to do all of the following. When reviewing guidelines, review the proposed guidelines to ensure that they are required by uh, and consistent with state law, ensure the proposed guidelines are available to the public 45 days before considering the guidelines, adopt the guidelines by a majority vote of the commission at a duly noticed public hearing, maintain records of testimony and recommendations to the commission, uh, report to the legislature annually on any guidelines adopted by the commission, uh, seeks to establish this process to ensure that the CTC moves to adopt program guidelines when it does that it does so through a public process that is credible and transparent. Ask for your I vote. Uh, witnesses in support? Witnesses in opposition? Uh, Move the bill. Okay, the bill's been moved. Uh, call the roll. Kehoe? Aye. Kehoe, aye. Walters? Aye. Walters, aye. Alquist? Aye. Alquist, aye. Emerson? Lou? Aye. Lou, aye. Pavley? Price? Aye. Price, aye. Runner? Aye. Runner, aye. Steinberg? Uh, the vote six to zero. Uh, Thank you. We're gonna, uh, we're gonna hold the roll open for Senator Emerson. And alrighty. Pavley? There's just a few. Um, I just presented Senator Steinberg's bill. I'll take up the state claims bill, Madam okay. Chair. Uh, this is uh, an urgency measure, SB 207. Uh, it would appropriate $557,000 from various funds to the crime victim, to the Victim Compensation and Government Claims Board to pay 211 claims accepted by the board. Uh, of this fund, of this amount, approximately 542,000, you know, just a, a, a $10,000 difference or so, um, is from the general fund, uh, approximately 16,000 is from special funds. The Department of Finance supports the claims. Uh, there's no controversial uh, incarcerations or rulings in this. Uh, the proposed amendment corrects a code reference. There, it's a technical amendment and there is no opposition. Okay, witnesses in support. Uh, good afternoon, John Myers with the uh, Deputy Director of Victims Compensation Government Claims Board, uh, sponsor of the SB 207 here in support, asking for your I vote. Uh, witnesses in opposition, members of the committee, questions? Um, do I have a motion? Okay, please take the roll. Thank you. Kehoe? Aye. Kehoe, aye. Walters? Aye. Walters, aye. Alquist? Aye. Alquist, aye. Emerson? Lou? Aye. Lou, aye. Pavley? Aye. Pavley, aye. Price? Aye. Price, aye. Runner? Aye. Runner, aye. Steinberg? Uh, that's seven to zero and we'll, we'll hold it open. Thank you, Madam Chair. And then the last item today uh, is SB 747. Um, it is um, a due pass, I hope. Uh, it's based on, uh, based on the fiscal analysis from the Department of Finance. Uh, I believe it falls below the th uh, suspense threshold. It's a necessary bill that establishes parity for lesbian, gay, bisexual, and transgender Californians in, uh, who, who are receiving health care. Uh, who are compared to other communities with specific medical needs. Um, it, this law will require cultural competency, that is sensitivity training uh, for LGBT Californians who are patients. Uh, it is um, in it, it's same, uh, similar requirements to cultural competency for racial, ethnic, linguistic, uh, and gender-based disparities. Um, it is sponsored by Equality California. Uh, it passed out of committee, and we have some testimony in support. I ask for your I vote. Okay, witnesses in support. Good afternoon, Madam Chair, members of the committee. Mario Guerrero on behalf of Equality California. 
Quality California is the sponsor of SB 747. Uh, there is a severe problem that this bill addresses. Lesbian, gay, bisexual, and transgender people are being exposed to inadequate health care and their health is literally being put at risk simply because there's a lack of understanding of the, our health needs. Health and Human Services Secretary Kathleen Sebelius in a recent memo called for new and existing health care profession uh, training programs to include LGBT cultural competency. The memo states that Health and Human Service, uh, Services will develop cultural competency goals and promote the use of cultural competency curricula inclusive of LGBT populations in future grant guidance. LGBT cultural competency is necessary and it will put California in good standing for federal requirements. I respectfully ask for your eye vote. Thank you. Uh, any other witnesses in support? Witnesses in opposition? Questions of the committee? Do I have a motion? Uh, the bill's been moved by Senator Alquist. Kehoe? Aye. Kehoe, aye. Walters? No. Walters, no. Alquist? Aye. Alquist, aye. Emerson? Lou? Aye. Lou, aye. Pavley? Aye. Pavley, aye. Price? Aye. Price, aye. Runner? Runner, no. Steinberg? Uh, that's uh, five to two, and we'll hold the roll open. Thank, Thank you. you, Madam Chair. Okay, thank you, Senator Walters. Uh, members, we'll just go down the list for any members who were absent. Are we doing it uh, in file order? And these are just the due pass members, so for those of you who uh, were not here this morning or in and out, these are the ones you should be paying attention to. Okay, first is Senator Correa, SB 402. Uh, it is, uh, the chair is aye, the vice chair is no, and the vote is two to three. Uh, will you call the absent members? Lou? Aye. Lou, aye. Pavley? Aye. Pavley, aye. Price? Aye. Price, aye. Runner? Steinberg? This is Senator, this is Senator Correa. Uh, Senator Emerson, did he, did he vote on that? Okay, good. The vote is five to three, that's out. Uh, next is um, Senator Steinberg. I just presented this one, but some were absent. This is SB 126. I wanted... Steinberg, 126, uh, having to do with the California Transportation Commission. The vote is 6-0, the chair is aye, the vice chair is aye. Please call the absent members. Emerson, aye. Pavley? Aye. Pavley, aye. Steinberg? So that is eight to zero, that bill is out. Um, and then two by my, me, Kehoe, SB 207, state claims, uh, this uh, is $500,000 to settle claims. Uh, there's a technical amendment the chair is aye, the vice chair is aye, the vote is 7-0. Please call the absent members. Emerson? Aye. Emerson, aye. Steinberg? And that's 8-0, to zero. that bill is out. Next is uh, continuing education for uh, medical professionals for uh, LGBT patients. Uh, it is 5-2, to two. the chair is aye, the vice chair is no. Call the absent members. Emerson? Emerson, no. And that's five to three and that bill is out. Uh, we have uh, Senator Calderon, State Government Accountability, SB 617. Uh, the chair is aye, the vice chair is aye, vote is 6-0. Please call the absent members. Lou? Chair is an aye. Chair is an aye. Lou, aye. Pavley? Pavley, aye. Steinberg? Eight to zero, that bill is out. Next is Senator Evans, in-home support services. Um, the vote is three to three. The chair is aye, the vice chair is no. Please call the absent members. Lou? Aye. Lou, aye. Pavley? Pavley, aye. Steinberg? 
five to three, that bill is out. Uh, we have Senator Woke, uh, public contracts at the University of California. The vote is five to zero. The, both the chair and the vice chair are aye. Call the absent members, please. Lou? Aye. Lou, aye. Pavley? Aye. Pavley, aye. Price? Aye. Price, aye. Steinberg? Eight to zero, that bill is out. And I believe the last item today is Senator Ted Lou, workers' compensation liens. Oh, did we close the roll on that? Oh, yes. That was eight to zero, so we closed the roll on that one. Uh, there's no absent members there on, the, on uh, SB 863, correct? I think that is the end of the file. Thank you, members. And remember, next Monday is so far the longest file of the year. So uh, what time are we going to be starting? 6 a.m. in Senator Emerson's office for cinnamon rolls and coffee.